All right, so this is pretty much the first time I'm ever gonna tell this story. So we'll see how it works out. This is what I'm going to call the story of the country mouse goes to Las Vegas and discovers slot machines. <laughs> so I just came back a couple days ago from uh, Las Vegas where we were at a Tom Ferry elite retreat conference. If you're in real estate, you know Tom Ferry. If you're not in real estate, I'm gonna translate this to, I was in Las Vegas alone and unsupervised. So I get there and I'm a little bit early. I check into the hotel room and just to make myself comfortable, um, I start walking around the resort, which by the way was Mandalay Bay and it was actually pretty nice. I'm walking around the resort just to kind of get my bearings and you gotta walk through the casino. And here's all these slot machines. And there's, you know, lights and confusions and sounds. And I'm like, okay, casino, this is nice. I'm gonna go find out where we're supposed to be tomorrow, right? Get back to the hotel room a little bit later and I call my husband for the nightly check-in. And I'm like, so honey, I'm here and this is my room number and blah, blah, blah. And he says to me, he says, go have fun go loosen up a little bit, go put $20 in a slot machine and you know, go enjoy yourself, right? And think to myself, that sounds like fun. So I dutifully pick up all my stuff, go downstairs and I walk into the casino and I'm like, I'm gonna spend 20 bucks on the slot machines. I was intimidated because it's like lights and the, I'm, I'm not that type of person where I'm into nightlife. So I'm like, maybe another time, I just don't feel lucky. The next day, I'm meeting with um, my friends, and I happen to mention, yeah, Jim said I need to go play the slot machines, and they're like, oh yeah, you should. And as we finished up that day, um, they're saying, oh, are you gonna go play slot machines now? And I'm like, no, I'm, I'm just, I'm not feeling it. So we let that go. Next day, we go through that part of the conference, and they're like, Seriously, Teresa, your husband told you go play the slot machines. And I'm like, okay, this is my time. I'm gonna go lose 20 bucks, but at least everybody's gonna stop talking to me about playing the slot machines. So I go and I check it out and I figure out how this is supposed to go because, you know, spoiler alert in case you haven't figured it out yet, I don't gamble. This was my first time in Las Vegas in 30 years and the last time I was there, it did not look like this. So I'm like watching people like, okay, so the money goes in there and then you do this and what happens if you win? Oh, you go over here and this is how you get your money. You know, I've got to like, I'm gonna go do this. I'm all psyched up, I'm gonna go do this, right? So I pick out this machine and this machine looks like one of my favorite nighttime game shows, Wheel of Fortune. I'm like, okay, how hard can this be? So I take the $20 bill and I slide it into the slot and the machine like comes to life. And it's like, hello, welcome. We are so glad you could join us on Wheel of Fortune. And I'm like, okay. And I go and I pull down on the arm and it goes, da -da 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 -da. no win. I'm like, yeah, this is to be expected, right? And then I see that there's a button that just is like repeat. And I'm like, well, this looks pretty sophisticated. I don't have to pull down this arm here. I'm just gonna hit this button here. So second time, da 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 no win. Okay, third time, da 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 no win. Okay, but I promised, you know, now it's like, this is, this is a challenge. I am gonna play these slot machines so that I can call my husband tonight and say, honey, I, Laid the slot machines, we're done. Hit the button again. All of a sudden, oh my God, light and sirens and sounds and like this wheel of fortune icon is like, like totally lighting up like, I have never seen so much neon in my life. And it's like, okay, so press this button, blah, 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 blah. And all of a sudden it just keeps going like louder. And I'm like, what did I do? And then it starts going ding 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 ding, and I'm watching the counter going, you know, winning and winning and winning. And I guess I I did like a times four, you know, bonus spin or something like. I don't know. I still don't know. But here's what I do know, is that I looked at the amount that it said that I won, 
and I was like, there's a button, it says cash out. I'm cashing out. <laughs> and I walked away with, you know, some, some money. So I'm like really excited and thinking, okay, this was fun. And I go and I coach one of my friends at the conference. I'm like, okay, I finally played the slot machines and I won this much money. And the message comes back to me and says, okay, great, go win more. And I went back and said, heck no i worked too hard for my money that's it we're done and uh that was it that was the the country mouse from the mountain going to the big bad city of las vegas las wages playing the slot machines for the first time and coming away with a win and by the way that money is still in my wallet <laughs> so that was the uh, the trip to Las Vegas and the slot machines is what it is. I feel silly telling the story, but uh, okay. I hope that was enjoyable for somebody.